40-year-old Jamoke Davis is the Swiss Army knife of journalists. He has the ability to take on nearly every step of the production process single-handedly. While I think of myself as like a 5-2 player because I can produce, direct, write, be on camera, edit, I never had that one track where I said, I'm going to be great at this. What may be Davis's greatest strength is drawing from his experience in different areas to manage Monumental Network as the director of network productions. Jamoke's diverse background in production allows him to see uh, production at all angles, and he helps out the different people in their position. Davis oversees the direction of a network that covers sports in Washington, while also having the time to work hands-on with the content. On this day, he is directing a holiday shoot for the Washington Mystics. He also interviews superstar athletes. Paul, you said that's why they brought you here. Hosts a podcast. And we're talking the Washington Wizards. And serves as the executive producer of the Emmy award-winning Wizards magazine. The DC native had a unique start to his career, beginning as a 14-year-old reporter covering the Seoul Olympics. Him at 14, to just come out and be on the scene and do well, not just participate, but do well, that's amazing to me. His desire to make it in the industry led to his decision to leave college after his freshman year. It was just, it was just bizarre because I just felt like I didn't need school and that it, it just wasn't important for me to be on camera. After working a variety of roles behind the camera, Davis earned his degree at the University of Pittsburgh. I had a couple of different paths that I went on to get to where I am today, but I'm pretty happy with, with what I've accomplished. Davis embodies what it means to be a multimedia journalist in the digital age and prides himself on telling stories that transcend sports. From Verizon Center for Howard University News Service, I'm Jordan Henry.